Hello, welcome back Farmers and Larry Club members. Today I'm going to show you an introduction to Sugarcane from the Platinum Edition. This video was posted by uh, Farming Simulator on YouTube and Facebook and all that. I'll leave the link in the description to the original one. So if you guys want to check that out, you can. And if you guys like this video, make sure you guys pound the like button. And if you guys haven't subscribed, make sure you guys subscribe. If you guys haven't followed us on Twitter, make sure you guys do. It's at FS Club Xbox. Or we are now partnered with the Facebook community. And I'll leave that link in the description in case you guys want to join that. Put the news on there and mods and testing just like we do in the club for the xbox well here's the video and thank you guys for watching and thank you for being a member of this club and channel thank you guys bye welcome to south america welcome back to farming simulator 17. we're excited to tell you more about the new crop available in the platinum edition sugarcane ready to start your sugarcane farm here are all the basics you need to know to plant sugarcane, you need to get a special billet planter. You can fill it, as usual, with sugarcane pallets from the store. Or you can also use some stalks from your last sugarcane harvest. Then it's time to get out on the field. Don't forget to beat the local traffic. Be patient after you're done planting. Compared to other crops, sugarcane takes quite long to grow. Once it's ready for harvesting, it looks quite impressive though. Even better, it won't wither, so you can take your time and harvest it whenever you want to. So let's start harvesting. Get the new Case IHA 8800 Multi-Row, a sugarcane trailer wagon like the TT Colossus or the MF3012. Grab yourself a friend online or use a helper for the harvester. Sit back and enjoy the ride. Once the wagons are full, you can choose how to further handle your harvest. Take it to your farm for temporary storage, for example. To do so, just find a nice, sheltered spot on the ground. You can also store sugarcane in one of the many grain elevators used for train transportation. Or just bring your harvest to the local sugarcane mill with one of the new Radon tippers and sell a lot of it in one go. Once you've sold your first batch of sugarcane, it's smooth sailing from here on out. Sugarcane grows back without the need of sowing it again. Convenient, isn't it? When playing on the higher game difficulty, the ground will be too strained for further field work after three harvests. This means it's time for one of our new subsoil cultivators, like the Stara Aza Laser CR DCR13. Afterwards, all that's left to do is sow again and the fun can begin once more. Have fun playing with our new crop available in the Platinum Edition. <laughs> 